Oh boy, oh boy, hey, welcome back, you be to another video here on the channel. How you all doing? Welcome back. How you doing, bros? You having a good day? Hopefully you're having a good day. Thank you for popping by the video today. We're taking on one of the caves now. Uh, I think we're going for the cavern of the lost faith today, which I mean... Yeah, it should be the easier one out of the two water caves. I don't have an otter still, so we can only get one artifact, which is fine because apparently there's good loot down there. So, um, I mean, let's go down there. Um, I have pretty much done more renovations to the area. Let me show you this first of all. Um, oh, and we've got the final level from Killing Rexes. <laughs> so here's the final level. Where am I going to push the final one into? I think we've got to do everything's going to be odd. So I don't actually know where to put this right now. If we put it into movement speed, I don't know. That was a bit of a wasted one, but still. Level 100, hell yeah. Look at the downstairs. Downstairs is cleaned up. And we've actually extended it. With the, the wall used to come to here, um, to this like beam. But now it's over there. Okay, let me show you the kitchen first of all. Oh, hey, look at this. Nice little seating area. You can seat next to the Rex and be like, hey, Mr. Rex, you've got the grill here. You've got this, which will be picking up crops and stuff. Very cool. Uh, you got our cooking pot, which is actually something that we need. We need the Lazarus Chowder, before I forget. And then my fridges. We come through here. This is my really crappy storage area. And this is a backup egg collector for not what I didn't want them for these. But apparently it's collecting these anyway. So, okay. I had to fix the ignore list on that one. This is just dump while I try and sort everything out. And now you can walk through here. Bloop, and get straight into here. Where you've got all of my... Instruments of mass destruction. <laughs> um, and then you can get back into the house quickly that way. Or you can run through the front door. That's what the house looks like right now. But there is one more building. What's that behind me? I've built something else. Look at it. <laughs> I have built uh, a breeding pen. Uh, but not breeding pen, like a hatching pen. Because I was getting sick of not being able to see which dinos were in the grass. So I built this, but it just looked odd. Just having, like, wood foundations out in the open so i had to build something a little bit bigger and i made it into like a mini bar try to keep the style of everything else like a mini bomb and up top is where i'm going to put the flyers obviously to stop breeding as you can see there's the male perfect female perfect and the health mutation for the rg and uh yeah this is pretty much what i've added <laughs> we've also added mosey into here for the polymer farm thank you to da turtle 7 for the idea i completely forgot the moss chops gives better polymer rates if you up the polymer um that is on me i'm sorry then we can also get through here we've got this all going on there uh, yeah everything sort of works and i'm pretty sure actually we need health brews that is what i'm missing as i say we're pretty much there but we need some health brews uh let's do 20 i think that should be more than enough for the cave that's gonna start going through there i'm just gonna wait for that i'm gonna get my basilos which are down below i think i might need a couple of basilo saddles before we disappear um, and then I think we're pretty much done. I got the bullets that I crafted, not too many. And then the bass. Let's make. Uh, we got three bass low, so I want to make. Uh, well, I think we got two down there, so let's make two of those. We're also making some grappling hooks, uh, just because it'd be a lot easier. So let's take these bass low saddles. The claw! Okay, we're pretty much ready. So I am going to fly. I'm going to grab my bass lows, which are down here. That We've got three that are fully imprinted. Um, and then we're going to go to the next area and hopefully, <laughs> hopefully we'll be able to finish this base today or this cave today. Okay, so we're here at 5310, which is the cave location. And it's here on the map if you really want to know. We're here. We're like here. 5310. It should be below us here. Uh, we're on half cooked, which is my higher level version of these basilos. Uh, I call it half cooked because it looks like a sausage and the underside looks like it's never cooked. <laughs> so we're here right now. I'm going to get changed into these clovages real quick. Uh, what else do we need? We need the trousers. There we go. So we've got our suit all up and running, which is great. I should have everything on me. I think I do. We've got everything on the hot bar. We've got the Lazarus Chowder in case we need it, which we shouldn't do unless the tanks break, which, you know, is a possibility. We've got grappling hooks. We've got arrows. We've got, okay, we've got everything. We're ready. We're ready. I just want to ask you guys, before we carry on, the support on this series at the moment has been amazing. The last two episodes have got over 100 views, which, I mean, I really appreciate that. That's all I've ever asked for um, in my whole YouTube 
time making videos is to like at least get 100 views on a video which i mean we're hitting so many milestones it's amazing i just want to say thank you so much for supporting the channel i really appreciate you and if you could just let me know down below if you're enjoying this series or if you've got any improvements on what i can improve on for this series i really appreciate it if you could let me know um it means the world to me thank you so much uh, let's get into this let's go diving and see if we can get ourselves some awesome loot which is not the main reason that we're going down here but it is one of the reasons let's go bachelo hey so this guy's actually super fast i think my imprinted rates are was super high because this guy is extremely fast and normally they feel quite slow and sluggish so um here we go here's the cave literally right on the spot that's not bad you know um i will gamma up for you guys because it's um a little bit dark so this it will look a little bit faded out Actually, the inside looks quite bright. Why is the inside of the cave brighter? Okay, maybe we'll be fine like this. Um, I could take the mask off for better viewing experience. Because I, I find it so annoying that you have to look through the mask when you're in this part. Okay, so... Uh... Oh, God, the silica pills, man. Oh, damn, I could do with a lot of these. Let's just carry on this way. I'm not sure what sort of damage this guy does. Maybe I should have tried to level it before coming into the cave. I'm pretty sure this should be... A... I'm pretty sure this should be quite easy. Is that the explorer note there? I think it is. I might try and get that. Do I need to get it? No. I, ah, no. We don't need to get it. I mean, it wouldn't go be on my... Oh! <laughs> what level is that? <gasps> oh, my God. Okay, there's an alpha Mosa in this cave. Uh, I'm just going to... Hopefully, it doesn't go after me. I'm just going to go down here. Maybe. Oh, I didn't even know. Do we need to get past that guy? I think we need to get past it. This is the way out. Oh, man. This is not good. This is really not good. I need to get past that guy. I guess I could cryopod my Bastlo and run across. Right, I'm going to try to go into this alpha Moza right now. <laughs> just be like, no, don't mind me. I'm just coming. Oh, my God. There's a crate here as well. All right. Is he coming after us? Dude, I think it's stuck. Okay, I'm going to just take that as a win at the moment. Grab this. Whoa. What have we got? Anything good? Ah, trike, bro. I thought that, I honestly thought that was Rex saddled in. I'm not going to lie. I got super excited. Okay, well, let me carry on. I haven't seen anything evil apart from that Moza, which we will kill eventually. I think. Not that I need to level up because I'm leveled up fine. I'm max level now, but maybe get levels on this Moza. So, I don't know. I was expecting more resistance in this cave. I'm not going to lie. Is that the artifact as well? We've literally just got the artifact, and there was nothing. <laughs> I got... There was nothing, bro. Bam. Artifact of the bruise. Done. <laughs> I literally... I, I, didn't, I, didn't run in, I didn't run into anything. That's crazy. I will gamble up for you again, because it's getting a little bit dark. But, um... Yeah, there was nothing here. I'm just going to check on land, uh, because there might be some stuff up here that we can get. I also... I have brought my Boseman. So we can get around a little bit faster. Uh, technically, I could take these off while I'm on this bit. Hey, well, here we go. Let's attack this Moser. Basically, going to be a lot of clicking. So I think it's stuck. So we're both attacking it right now. I'm doing 500 damage. The other one's doing about 300, I believe. I think it's actually attacking Salmon. My whistle attack my target. So we're doing about 800, 900 damage close to every hit. Which is not bad. This guy isn't fighting back. So this is going to be a super easy kill. I can't believe that. <laughs> this guy's just stuck in here. Ah, you poop mosa. It's a super high level though. So it's going to take us such a long time. But we're going to level up a bunch. Which is so good. Hey! We got it! Wow! How many levels did we go for? That was a level 300 Moser. Alpha Moser, not even like Lilo Moser. Oh, 39 levels, and we got some loot! Not if it's what I need, though. <laughs> oh, okay, so we got an, another crossbow, which we've got better. We got a normal bow and some chitin armor. Okay, so after that, um, I'm gonna make my way to the second sea cave because, uh, I mean, the uh, second ocean cave, because, I mean, that was super easy. 
So uh, it wasn't really enough to call it an episode, and we didn't get that much stuff done. So uh, is that a drop in the cave in the freaking water? Damn, bro, I didn't even know that was a thing. We are at the Cavern of the Lost Hope, which is the second cave, and it might be a little bit more difficult. I don't know. We'll see if it's a little bit more difficult. Might not need to gamma up again, but we will see shortly. Um, is this definitely... Oh, wow. Really? Okay, so we've already got an alpha on us. At least this time we're doing 500 damage because we leveled up so much. We'll take on this alpha just because we can get the levels from this guy. <clears throat> but I'm pretty sure... Oh, this cave is already going to be more difficult. Oh, definitely more difficult. There's a lot of stuff in here. I don't know how I'm going to survive this. <laughs> oh, my God. Half my health's almost gone. Maybe I should have pumped more into health. Damn. All right, any next levels will pump into health. Oh, them eels are killer. I think the eels are doing the most damage out of everything here. Um, I think we'll definitely take it. Uh, we'll get out another mo uh, Basilo, another Basilo, and we'll try and get the mate boosted of efficiency going. That might be good. Okay, so we've took out the majority of the stuff here. There's another eel going around. That's fine. There's Megalodon still going for us, and it's not looking bloody. I uh, bet it's a stupid level. That's probably why. Oh, stop coming. Oh, stop, stop coming. Leave me alone. <laughs> Leave me alone. I don't think I'm going to survive this one. Um, I, I got a feeling that we're not going to survive. The fact that we're already down to 9,000 health. Crazy. But we will, with all these levels that we're getting, we'll definitely level up health. And then I'll do some healing for a bit. Hey, okay, so we killed the Megalodon. How much? Okay, we've got 2,000. Um, oh, we've got over 2,000 meats. That's fine. We've got some not so good stuff. Okay, never mind. Let's start by... Uh, we'll go wait for them levels to come through. And then we'll kill this guy. All right, so we kill that guy, and then we're going to chuck out the second Baslow to give the uh, effect. So if we do that, and then we go like this, and then we go options, no, behavior, follow distance to lowest. It should always stay by us, which means that we're going to have that mate boost. Okay, and then we're also going to put it on um, attack my target. Okay, so I'm going to heal up. It's going to take a while. We only went up two levels there, so I'm going to pump... Um, into here, and then we're just gonna start eating. And it won't take too long, but I will be gone for a little while. Alright, let's get this Dunkleo while we're over here. Gosh darn it. Oh my god, there's a lot of Dunkleos. Okay. And these are quite armored as well, they're super tanky. Oh, that did not just happen. Oh, boy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. I had a power cut. Ah, no. I had a power cut. This is not fair. This is not fair. Please say all my stuff is there, at least. I think my bass is probably going to die. Um, yeah. Jesus Christ, bro. Power cuts at the worst time. At the absolute worst. Okay, can I get my stuff back? Oh, thank God for that. Okay, so we've got the stuff back. I'm going to quickly fly back over there and try and claim or make sure the bass is safe. Wait, how have I gone up a level? I thought I couldn't go up any more levels. Okay, 101. I thought you'd have to beat bosses to go past 100. Okay, so we're back on track. I've made it back to the cave. Um, I haven't had anything pop up to say stuff has died. Luckily, we had three basses. <laughs> this is why I had prepared three. So we had two out, had one left in my infantry. This is why we had three. Um... Hopefully now I can get back to my other two before they die. The route should be clear at least. Um, oh my god, stuff has already started spawning back. Okay, well, we're going to try and avoid this. Okay, there we go. Uh, attack. That's all I want you to do, just attack. They should be on attack my target. See if I start... Okay, or, you know, just attack my target, please. If I accidentally hit a group again. No, I'm not in a group. Attack! <laughs> so I was on Discord while I was uh, while waiting for the power to come back on. And come back over here. It turned out that I wasn't supposed to kill that Moza. The people left it there for a reason because it stopped everything spawning. But I didn't know. I didn't get the memo. <laughs> so uh, I just killed a Moza, which means everything's going to start spawning in that cave again. Uh, which make it a little bit more difficult. But that's fine. Okay, you fine? Are you finally joining in? Yeah? No? Don't leave me here to die. Join in. Oh, God. I know another anglerfish. I just need to sort out my dinos. 
I need to cry up on the bass eaters leave dead. My guys are still pretty safe, so we should be able to carry on this cave without actually having too much of an issue. Did you have anything on you that was useful? I mean, I'll take these. So, half cooked, half baked, half cooked. Right, are you going to start attacking stuff? So we're at half health. Let me... We should have some stuff for me to heal up. We haven't got much left. And stuff's coming again. Okay. Oh, we're back on it. These Megalodons literally just come from everywhere. You just kill what you hit one and then they're all like, yeah, I'm going to get you. Actually, I'd prefer to have Megalodons coming after me than them Dunkleos. Jesus, they're tanks. They're absolute tanks. These Megalodons are easy to kill. Literally, the other Basilo is just serving as a machine to give me the boost that I need. Okay, I'm jump off to get this guy uh, real quick. Ooh. Okay. Do I fight this guy or not? Uh, preferably not. If they're going to leave us alone, I will happily accept that. There's another loot drop down here which I want to try and swim for. I may piss off a lot of things. This is probably a stupid idea. Ah, it is a stupid idea. A Megalodon's coming after us. Oh, uh, it's bringing all its friends. Okay, let's start fighting. Okay, so we're just healed up a little bit more. I haven't fully healed up after that fight. Jesus, I nearly died. Uh, but let's go and grab this real quick. Uh, what we got? We got a Diplo and a Megalodon. I mean, that's pretty cool. All right, let's carry on through this cave. I mean, ah, oh, jeez. This is a difficult one. I'm spending more time healing than actually fighting. <laughs> uh, there's an eel there, which I don't really want to deal with. Is this the way? Uh, let's keep going this way, then. I really don't know where I'm going in this cave. I felt like I, felt like I did, but I'm lost. Oh, is there an explorer note down there? I will grab that. I mean, I don't really need levels on this guy now, but... I guess it will still help. Okay, so I stayed on land for about 10-15 minutes <laughs> while I had to go and do something. Luckily, nothing came and killed us. Uh, we had our basses here. But, uh, yeah, uh, we've been joined by Matt. Matt is just chilling here. <laughs> um, I'm pretty lost. For I'm pretty sure... Well, no, I don't know what's happening. Let me get this guy. <laughs> I have no clue what's happening. I think I've missed the artifact. I'm pretty sure that it's just around the corner from here, but we'll double check. Um... I did say that I'm back, but I don't think anyone's here right now. They're just waiting. I'm going to disappear. It's good. I'm going to be like magic. It's going to be like a magician. There's another Basilo here. Okay, whose is this? Blood Wolves. Okay, cool. Now, I'm pretty sure that it's down here. Or it's around here, at least. Ah, there it is. Okay. I see it now. Oh, damn. That's a lot of stuff. Why is everything not coming after us? Oh boy, there's a lot of evil. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just go for it. <laughs> They're gonna stop following us. Okay, and here's the artifact. I remember now. Jesus, my guy's gonna die. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go collect this artifact real quick. Oh, actually, let me jump back on this guy. Kill these real quick. Oh yeah, let's get this artifact. That was quite difficult. I wish I had an otter to give it up some more, but I really do not. Uh, do we have any... Any more things around here? I don't think so. No more drops, is there? No, okay, I'm just going to swim out. Unfortunately, that Basilo is going to be sacrificed because he's not getting out of here. That was too bad, actually, you know. Yeah, he's gone. My bad, I'll have to leave you. I'm sorry. I just want to get out of here now. And we're out. That wasn't too bad. Alright, everything's respawned. I've been that I've been away that long that everything's respawned. Oh, there's another drop there. If I'm quick. If I'm quick. I don't know what I got. A tape jar and a pterodon. <laughs> Pretty crappy actually. I'm gonna keep on running. I can get out of here. <laughs> oh wow. There's a lot of creatures. Everything's respawned in this cave. I think I would definitely come back to this cave at some point. I mean, it wasn't too bad. It was difficult, but with the second Bassy, um, we should be fine. Obviously, we did leave our Bassy in there. <laughs> Let's have a look at loot stuff. Did we get anything cool? We got a lot of blueprints. The Megalodon saddle, which is pretty cool. 
Uh, Diplo saddle, which isn't that good. Uh, we've got a shield. We've obviously got the artifact. We should have another artifact from the last cave. There we go. Um, uh, we could chuck that in there. Let me chuck that in there. We've got the tape jar. That's not too bad. I think that's it, really. Oh, the other Bassy did actually have some stuff in the inventory, which we probably could have got. Hey, anyway, well, that's pretty much it. We've got two more... Two more of these, which is great. Two more artifacts. We've got a bunch of resources, which I don't know how I'm going to carry back. Um, we're probably going to have to fly back, because I don't think this guy's going to be able to swim through the swamp. Well, that's not too bad, at least. Um, I'm going to end that episode there, because this has been super long, and I did have to disappear, because I've got some other stuff on. So, um, I really appreciate everyone for watching. Um, that has been the two... Uh, sea caves, the two water caves, the ocean caves. Uh, we do pretty well, to be fair. That wasn't too bad at all. Check it out, and we survived. Uh, apart from the power cup. But yeah, uh, I'm, I'm happy with that. Let me chuck down this guy, and I'm gonna fly back to base. Thank you all for watching, guys. If you enjoyed, make sure you like button, subscribe to become a human beam. And I'll see you in the next episode. Have a fantastic day. Bye.